My name's Eric Chang, and we are going to be walking through Unit 505 here at the Arena District Lofts. Let's take a look at this contemporary style apartment. All right, as we walk in here, we're presented with an art gallery style hallway. You can see that it's accented with curtains, white mushroom columns, brushed nickel chandeliers, there are really wide high ceilings with exposed plumbing and ductwork and the unit is white plank hardwood espresso floors throughout except for the bedrooms. So once we step into the bedroom here, it's a decent sized bedroom. We have the concrete stamped ceilings which are about a foot thick of concrete in between units, so you don't hear the pitter-patter of feet like you do with other units that have wood frame. So these ceilings are actually 11 to 14 feet. Again, the exposed plumbing, there's exposed ductwork. You can see this industrial style layout here. It's also got interior lit closets, so let's take a look here. It is a normal size closet for a unit this size, but interior lit, which makes it nice. Okay, let's step outside. And here is your coat closet or guest closet, and that is interior lit as well. Now, this unit is furnished. So everything you see here will come with the unit, including the artwork that's hung on the walls and throughout the unit. And in here, we've got the master bedroom. So we've got two contemporary style chandeliers and the exposed ductwork continues throughout this whole unit. Okay, and then we've got here, is a dressing area or an office space nook. This furniture also does stay with the unit. And we have the coolest bathroom ever. It is completely contemporary. We've got these glass vessel sinks here, brushed nickel designer faucets, and these are your maple shaker style cabinets. And then this bathroom, as well as the other bathroom, is ceramic tile down here. And also the commode is wall hung and the flush valve is part of the wall. It's just the style that we have in this building. We've got a seamless glass shower here. With a little bit of a seat and then the ceramic tile backsplash and your towel hook holders are right over there. As we walk into the master bedroom closet, we've got an alpha organizer closet system. You don't really even need a dresser with this alpha organizer closet system. You've got baskets, you've got shelves that come out. You can see that there are all sorts of hangers for pants down here. Uh, this will lift up. 
you wanted to get at the underneath on that basket. Jewelry organizer or whatever else you may want to put in there. Shelves throughout. It comes with a washer and dryer right here in the master bedroom closet. So as soon as you're done washing your clothes, you don't need a laundry basket. You can take them out and hang them right up on the hangers or the ironing board is right here for your convenience. So let's take a look back out here. We'll walk back through. And take a look at the rest of the unit. Okay, as we come down this hallway, this is the guest bathroom or the other full bathroom. And it has the same style as the other master. You can see the ceramic tile floor, the wall hung commode with the flush valve part of the wall. And then there's a pedestal style sink. And you've also got contemporary fixtures. The full bathtub has ceramic tile backsplash in the same color as the other bathroom. This is just your utility room. In case you're wondering what these two doors do, it's where your water heater and furnace is. And let's come out here to the grand part of the condo. As I said, everything you see here is furnished. And your main living area would be right here. Exposed style ductwork goes throughout the unit. You've got the contemporary light floodlights, mini floodlights. And then kitchen here. So it does have the stainless steel appliances, granite countertops here. We've got mosaic glass tile backsplash all throughout. And then maple style shaker cabinets also matching. Backlit cabinets give this kitchen a very nice style and accent. When we go to the sink here, it's a one full deep sink that's undermounted. Undermounted sinks are great. It makes it easy to clean these counters and the contemporary fixtures. Here's your soap di dispenser here. And this will come right out. Okay. The dishwasher here is in two different sections. So if you've got a smaller load, you can just load it here in the bottom and wash separately. And then we've got the range here and the microwave stainless steel. Now what's cool about this island is it's on wheels. So you can actually move the position of this island if it doesn't fit your needs where it is right now and the wheels do lock. So they're locked right now, won't move them, but I wanted to point that out. There's also extra space underneath the island here, should you need it. And then we can step out here to the terrace. So all this patio furniture here does come with the unit. And if you take a look, it's got the same high ceilings, chandeliers, give you some light out here during the night. And right out here is the arena parking garage, is what you're across. And that is the nationwide building. Now we're on the top floor of this unit.
Okay, step back inside. Let's get a shot of the rest of the... Unit from the other side. We are in the Arena District. You're literally a three minute walk away from all of the restaurants, the movie theater, the arena, and you're a few blocks south of the short north. And you're also very close to the high street area where there are additional restaurants. Just about everything here is within walking distance. And this unit does also come with two parking spots, which is pretty rare for buildings in the downtown area. Most of these condo units come with one parking spot. So another great benefit. And there you have it. Unit 505 at the Arena District Lofts. Thanks for watching.